Women say they have found an unconventional way to lose weight while gaining muscle tone, but sometimes they are reluctant to tell a lot of people about their often misunderstood fitness routine. You're going to see why in a second, because Meg Ferris shows us in tonight's Weight Loss Wednesday, it is working for them. Yes, we can schedule a maintenance for you. By day, Crystal Adams manages an air conditioning company and works on cell tower sites, okay, but you. in between, she works on her passion. At 42, Crystal says teaching pole classes combines her love of dance, fitness, and powerful strength. But it also saved her from an eating disorder. She got down to 78 pounds. From that moment on, I've been the same weight for 20 years. But I've never had a problem with like actual eating disorders again, because I need the strength and I need the calories to do this. Only women are allowed to enchantress dance and fitness in Harahan. She sees their weight and clothes coverings go down while their fitness and confidence goes sky high. Well, it just changes people from, you know, not loving themselves to loving themselves. And I see it, and I think that's what drives me, just seeing women, like, literally heal and loving their bodies for what they can do versus what they look like. You really could not pull yourself up even an inch when you first started? Not even to get off the floor. It's pretty cool. It's pretty awesome feeling to, just to see how you can improve in, in a year. Crystal Roddy is a mom. The pandemic packed on 10 pounds. Afterwards, she didn't feel like going back to a gym. It doesn't feel like working out. I'm way more flexible than I have ever been. I don't have any background in dance or cheer or anything like that. I've never been able to wear a crop top so I can come here and feel comfortable in my clothes. Just more confident. So confident she's having her 40th birthday party here. Erica Parker is a mom who also wanted to get fit after the COVID lockdowns. I've definitely lost weight. I think that I just feel more confident about myself in general. Um, I think that when I first started coming, I was really shy about what I was wearing and about, you know, what other people look at me or how other people feel about it. And I was just really conscious of what everybody else might think. If you own your own pole and crash mat, you can take the class virtually. They log on as far away as England. There are also Lyra Hoops, where you can learn circus art. Or if you need the feeling of more support, you can add pole silks. Liquid Motion teaches you how to move on the floor, and the Hell on Heels class strengthens your ankles to work in those high platforms. And believe it or not, they are functional. Heavy so you can gain strength, plastic so they stick making it easier to climb, and high to elongate your height for when you have to reach for a posed position. The walls are lined with Crystal's awards from competition, but for women like Cheryl Van Geffen, the competition is with her own body to stay fit and healthy. I live with discomfort and nausea every day, yet I can come into this studio and for an hour, I'm not feeling pain and I'm not nauseated. And I work through it and I forget about it. At almost 59, she's a cancer survivor. I came one for the fitness, the fitness aspect. And what I found was a family. And what I found was a great creative outlet. Of all the dance you've done in your life, why pole dancing? It just gave me freedom. Today I might want to be slow and sexy. Tomorrow I might want to be powerful and, you know, push out power moves. Every day it can change. For Weight Loss Wednesday, I'm Meg Farris. Women who are taking the class range in age from 16 to their 60s. And we have more information about those classes on WWLTV.com.